We're good. All right, I'd like to welcome everyone to this episode of uh, Green TV. We're going to uh, focus on World Water Day. That's uh, March 22nd. It's a UN designated day that uh, first started back in 1993, uh, basically to uh, focus on the importance of fresh water and our need for a sustainable management of that resource. Today, approximately one billion people do not have uh, access to clean water and 3.3 uh, million lives are lost per year as a result, including up to 4,000 children per day. So it's uh, everybody's responsibility to uh, take uh, good care of our fresh water and to conserve it and to do the best we can with it. Um, for this uh, World Water Day, uh, we're actually launching uh, rain barrel sales through nonprofit organizations throughout Ontario. There's about 80 organizations that are participating, from Niagara Falls to Sarnia, from Ottawa all the way up to uh, Thunder Bay and Red Lake, and everywhere in between. Um, a rain barrel captures clean water off of your roof. It doesn't have any fluoride or uh, or uh, chlorine, therefore it's much better for your uh, plants and vegetables. Um, it's a, a free source of water. Uh, it keeps water from running into uh, storm sewers which uh, inundate our wastewater treatment plants. If you happen to live in the Toronto area, there's a, a downspout disconnect bylaw, so a rain barrel is essential in the Toronto area. Um, what else can I tell you about World Water Day? There's a new website recently set up, worldwaterday.ca, where you can find a lot of uh, events and links related to uh, water issues, and also a lot of the rain barrel sales are posted there, as well as on rainbarrel.ca. Thank you for your time.